What's up guys, Zone Ninja Warring Aviators and the Superman hat bringing you another video of the Fight Like web series where I take a character from comics, video games, movies, anywhere really and tell you how to fight like them. This time we are going over the beloved, the iconic Spartan. Alright, so um, in case you haven't figured it out yet, I don't mean Spartan as in like 300, I mean Spartan as in Halo. So if you want me to do, you know, the 300 Spartan, I can do that later, but that's for another day. So today, our Halo Spartans, we're going to be taking a lot of influence from um, the series on, uh, what's it called, Red versus Blue actually, we're going to be taking a lot of influence on there because that is when we see Spartans do more hand-to-hand -hand combat, more than, you know, the typical Spartan does because obviously Spartans shoot guns and so that's not what this series is about, like I, I, I could tell you about it, but here's the thing, most Spartan guns don't exist yet, so I can't really tell you how to fire those guns. Uh, if you want me to do an episode or, yeah, an episode over guns, I can have Joel hit that up for you, but let me know down in the comments if you want to see that. So for right now, we're going to focus on the, the physical hand-to-hand-ish combat for Spartans. And surprising, when I was uh, watching a ton of videos, like a lot, uh, I noticed that a lot of their fighting styles actually mimics uh, Tong Su Do very, very closely actually. There's some differences and some variations that they get slightly off, but for the most part, Tong Su Do is very close to um, the style they use. And I, the reason I noticed is because that's the style I use mostly. Uh, it's mixed with a couple other things, but mostly it's Hong Su Do. So um, that's gonna be your base. You're gonna throw a lot of straight punches, a um, lot of quick and powerful kicks. It's not super flashy, and that's one of the differences with Tong Su Do and um, the Spartans. They add a little bit of flair, not too much, just a little bit to make it more entertaining to watch. Now, basically all Spartans are powerhouses. They're incredibly strong and incredibly fast. I highly suggest finding yourself a Mjolnir armor and then going to town. But for those of you like myself that don't really have access to that, that's all right. Uh, because there are ways to generate that kind of power and that kind of speed, you know, naturally. Uh, for your power, using your core, using your hips to generate your power when you throw your punch, using that hip, pushing your hip forward and that pulling your arm forward, that will help you get a more powerful punch. Same with your kick, pushing your hips forward and that thrusting your kick forward will help you a lot in um, generating your power like a Spartan uses his you know, enhanced serum and his suit to gain extra strength. As far as speed goes, work on speed drills, whether it's you know dodging uh, your friend shooting tennis balls at you or just simply bouncing around and going in for a quick touch or going in for a quick touch then and then uh, circling around. Going through those sparring drills that I can go over in a different video if you want me to. But going through speed sparring drills is what's gonna help you a lot. And there's a ton of different ones that you can find. There's like, there's sparring drills everywhere on YouTube. So uh, if you wanna know my favorite ones, I will definitely let you know in a different video. Uh, I actually plan on having a fight like edge video at some point. Uh, I don't know when, It'll, there'll be a fight like all the Guardians video at some point. But uh, if you're interested in that, definitely share this video around, get you know more people to subscribe because it's gonna be like, you know, some uh, sub surprise or some, you know, celebration or something like that. Um, as I was saying, yeah, so if you wanna know more about that, we can go into that later. But definitely work on speed drills, definitely work on using your body to generate your power so that you can simulate super strength. Now next, the Spartans are actually uh, surprisingly really good at sword fighting. And I guess it's not surprising, I just didn't think that would come up, but it did with the Halo Energy Sword. Now, I really, really want a Halo Energy Sword. And guys, if you send me, if you, if you, if you guys buy me a Halo Energy Sword, you best believe you'll get a whole video dedicated to that sword. Maybe several videos dedicated to that sword. But since I don't have that, I'm gonna be using my blade sword that I got for a while ago for like 
I don't know, 50 bucks. I don't remember how much I bought. But it's really cool. I love this sword. And this is the sword I'm going to use later on in the video. But Spartans use a, a very interesting sword tactic because their sword comes out of their fist basically with their handle being like this and the blade going straight out. So they don't use it like you know a traditional sword where it would go up but that doesn't matter because you can still use it in a similar way so they do a lot of um swipes a lot of swipes uh with the energy sword because it has that double blade so you can go forward and back it doesn't matter which way you go uh also they do they do a lot of stabs i don't understand why they do a lot of stabs because the halo energy sword has has like it, it, I just don't understand like you punching into someone it's much more effective to swipe across at least that's my opinion I would swipe across but they do both and we're gonna go into some sword later but just remember when you're practicing the sword techniques you can't necessarily do it exactly how they do it simply because you know a normal sword's grip doesn't work like that it doesn't point the sword that way it goes up so when you're practicing your sword keep that in mind when you're working on sword techniques and what working on the sword technique you're gonna learn it later in this video lastly all Spartans carry a knife and that is very prevalent in the awesome assassinations from the video game and I'm actually going to teach you one of those assassinations uh, and in like the multiplayer games stuff like that with this knife right here. This is uh, one of my favorite knives. I got this at a convention. If you wanna know more about it, definitely check out the weapon, uh, I think, I can't remember what I call it. The weapon logs? Yeah, the weapon logs. So definitely check that out if you wanna know more about this awesome knife because it has some awesome features to it. Uh, but, so Spartans are excellent at close combat assassination. There are a ton of amazing ones and I'll eventually do them in, the, do each one in the Combat for Dummies um, uh, series. I'm not gonna do them all at once or do them all like right back to back because there are a ton. It would take me a long time. So uh, until then, I will show you one of them. I'm not sure which one yet. I'm kind of just gonna figure it out as I go. Gonna pick one at random. All right, so we are at the good part of this video where we go over the fighting techniques and the combos that you can practice at home in your backyard. So the first one is gonna be with nothing but our hands and our feet right here. We're gonna take stance just like this. This is how most of the Spartans fight with their hands up in a semi-boxing MMA style stance. So what you're gonna start off with is your back right going in for that upper or for that uh, the nose level right there just underneath the nose and using that hip to push that power into it pushing with your hip first to get that strength and then once you get that going your next one is going to be a left jab so one two just like that one two from here you're gonna take this leg slide it back spin into it back elbow just like that so one two spin in back elbow turn back around right hand hook just to finish him off hitting the hinge of the jaw so one more time one two three four and feel free to step into that because that just gives you more power i'll do it facing you so you can see it this way one two three four and one more time full speed So the next one is gonna be with our sword. Now remember, Spartans only ever use one hand on their sword, so get your wrist strength going. <laughs> so what we're gonna do is a three move fight here. You're going to block with that sword just like this. You're going to sweep under, sweeping at those legs. And then as they you know, slide their feet back to block their feet, you're going to stab through. So watch one more time, block. Sweep at the feet, or I shouldn't use both hands, my bad. Block, sweep at the feet, stab. All the way through, block, sweep at the feet, stab. Just like that. All right, lastly we have our assassination using my, uh, my knife right here. So, what we're gonna do, we're gonna start off on a fighting stance. This is called the spin cycle in Halo 5, I believe. What we're gonna do is you're gonna come in, 
blocking that first swing. So imagine they just took their right hook, blocking that first right hook, coming through and slicing, not stabbing, slicing through the, your opponent's ribs, your, their insides right here. So you're gonna come in, bang, slicing through and stepping behind. So I'm gonna do it facing this way so you guys can see a little bit better. You're going to block, go under that arm, slice the slice just under the ribs. You don't want to slice the ribs, just under it where their belly is. So block, slice, then you're going to flip the knife upside down, just like this. Come back around, grab them on the shoulder, and stab right in the back, just like that. Again, guys, these are as Halo assassinations. This will kill people, so be careful. Ready? So coming through, swipe, coming around, flipping the knife over, and finish. One more time, all the way through. One, two. Ugh, that was bad, I wanna do that again. One, two. Just like that. Now, I'm gonna have a little bit of a disclaimer, guys, because I want you to know something. Spartans are soldiers, and soldiers kill. That is their job. And so, uh, be aware that these techniques can seriously hurt or even kill someone, especially that assassination. And so, as though, I'll, as, you know, it's not good to use, you know, whenever you get in a simple street fight, but if your life is in danger, you're being kidnapped, uh, there's a bunch of people around you and you don't have anything but a knife. You have to protect yourself and that will protect you. Yes, that is, you know, very dangerous techniques to learn. But as a martial artist, as a martial artist in training, as I'm assuming you guys are, um, it's important for you to realize what does what, what kills people, what, what will maim people, what will break arms, what will break legs, what will not break anything, what will, you know, just put people down without breaking anything. It's important to be able to, to have those distinctions and have that option. So, disclaimer, don't go around stabbing people. That's, you know, not good. But if you are in a dire situation, if you are in a life-threatening situation, then by all means, do what you need to do to protect yourself. So, with that said, I hope you enjoyed this video. I loved being able to watch all the Halo videos and being able to just uh, look at a bunch of different Halo stuff that I haven't seen in years, to be honest. Uh, so if you want me to do something in particular, let me know down in the comment section below. Until next time, my name's DJ Moore. This is The Modern Ninja, and I'm out.